Goodbye, Jax. Bye, guys. Have fun. It was nice knowing you. Yeah, I told you parking would be terrible here. So. Oh, man. Yo, what is up, you guys? We are here in Seattle at the fish market. Uh, downtown, I suppose. Uh, it's the public market. I came here just to throw fish today, and we're going to see if we can do that. This is the fish market right here. I just came to see some fish being thrown. If someone buys a fish, then they're going to throw it. That's how it happens. Oh, my God. If someone buy yeah. a fish. How much is one of these? Which one? You go by the pound or? Yep. Okay. What's, yeah. what's oh, a typical oh, oh, oh. fish go for? Uh, man, there's nothing typical, man. No? Okay. No. I mean, you can buy a rainbow trout for seven bucks. You can buy a big old king salmon for a thousand. Wow. Yeah. See that again. That's great. You guys see that again. We gotta get a better angle and slow there. 45 bucks for one of these? Yeah. Wow. Okay. I don't even like fish. I just want to do this. My friends like fish though. Cool. So they'll eat it. All right, man. All right, Behind the counter with you. Here we go. Sockeye! Sockeye! Cut the hell out of that fish! Yeah, I did. Oh yeah, I did. Oh, oh yes. Appreciate it, guys. You're welcome, man. That, that is that was ever. epic. That was epic. All right. I'm just so happy that I caught that fish. Dude, I, I, you got I, I seriously it. did not think I was gonna catch it. Like, it was so slippery in the way they wanted me to catch it. I thought it was gonna slip right out of my I fingers. thought you weren't gonna catch it either. I yeah, really didn't. I didn't. I didn't. <laughs> but I'm so glad I did. Last one for this one. Last one for this one. Yeah. Oh. Oh. Yeah. No. He, he caught it with one, one hand. hand. Yeah. Look at that. These, these kids just put bubble gum on, on it too. I want to do that. Dude, last gum I could have. <laughs> Anyone? <laughs> nope. <laughs> Whoa, oh my god, it's a bubble gum alley. Yeah. Look at all of this gum. It almost looks like Willy Wonka's factory. It's pretty cool, but at the same time, it's pretty nasty if you like bump into this thing or if you touch this by accident. Like, look at this. <laughs> Dude, the goal is it's just dripping, <laughs> dripping gum. It's like a jail of gum. So you got some gum, huh? Oh yeah, ready? I want this one to be epic though. When I place this on the wall, they're gonna know like this guy screwed up in the head for what he you did. You have to do it up there. I'm gonna take the gum, I'm gonna drip over that part. Oh, uh, you're, gonna, you're gonna be a dripper, huh? I'm a dripper. <laughs> This is probably one of the nastiest things I think I've ever found. <laughs> okay. Alright, here we go. Dun 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 dun! dun. I, want my, I want mine to drip long! <laughs> I think that's the longest one, man. That's the longest drip. You did it. Dude, if anyone's tall that plays basketball, their, their head's gonna touch my gum. <laughs> Guess who got us fish? <laughs> 50 bucks? 50 bucks for that. No way. Yeah, yeah and I like don't fish. even like fish. <laughs> so that's for you guys. Yeah. My god, really good. Dude. Wait, this is like a, a raw fish. Yeah, like a real fish. He caught it. 
Yeah, I caught it. Oh, you caught it? Oh, no way. Oh, it's probably a salmon then. Maybe That's it is. That's crazy. Yeah. All right. Uh, so we are now heading out of Seattle. Unfortunately, we we're only here for a little bit, but we have to make it over to Palouse Falls, which is four hours away, and then make it out of this state to Montana, make our way down to Utah, because we only got a couple days until CVX Live. Five hours later, the sun is going down, and uh, we've made it just in time, I think, to see the, the uh, waterfall here. How do I get down here? The sun is just still here. We can get a couple pictures. Man, that's nice. Getting up even higher now, we can see the waterfall from above. But not only that, you can see the whole canyon. This is like walking the Grand Canyon again. What have you found with your investigative skills? So for the past hour, you know, I was down over there following the rim. And I found a way that could be possible to go down, but I seen a whole bunch of other people, there's no way they went down that way. Just by, I'm not really <laughs> judging, but there's no way they did it. So they must have went somewhere way over here that must go down a lot easier. So we're gonna go that so way. So you wanna investigate? Yeah, more. So using our investigative skills, we found that the road is over there. You can see it slightly go down. And then you have to walk this whole river, gorge, whatever this is, all the way over there to get to the waterfall. Because of the detectives that we are, we figured we'd probably get down there by the time it's dark because the sun has already set and uh, it's not looking like it's going to be an easy hike. So we're, we're trying to figure out if we're going to do this. But I don't think we're going to have time. Yeah, it's not by the worth time it. we get down there, it's going to be pitch dark and I want to do it, but you're no right, it's point. not worth it. Sucks, we couldn't get here a little bit earlier. But I did just find this super narrow pathway that looks to put you right above the top of the waterfall. Whoa. This is such a cool angle. I don't know how many people actually come out this far. You can see all the other photographers over there with their tripods getting the cool shots. But I feel like this is probably one of the best. Just not the safest. I'd say this is a pretty nice end to the day. Sitting here, staring at this waterfall, enjoying the view. From catching a fish today to walking down this alley filled with bubble gum, and then to this huge waterfall out in the middle of nowhere, literally the middle of nowhere. Uh, I think it's been a pretty, pretty successful day so far. So, Kayla, what do you think of our bus? I mean, <laughs> is it messy? It's like really, really messy. You guys need a maid or something? What? <laughs> <laughs> Wait, so you hear that, Jack? I, I think she's volunteering. Yeah. Is that right? Kayla, are you the cleaner upper? Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> so, sure. so, Kayla always been watching our videos for a while and she was nearby, so we told her to come over here to meet up with us. And now she's chilling. Mm -hmm. And then she's she's really we're making her really awkward because we're all filming her and she's camera yeah. shy <laughs> and she doesn't like the she <laughs> doesn't like the to be in, in there she is there she is that's too close my dude <laughs> <laughs> how many hours was it like three, three. I want to say damn that's it dedication. felt short yeah for some reason. I don't know because I was really anxious to get here I was like True. this is my present from Kayla <laughs> <Weedy boy. laughs> do you want to explain this because I don't think people are gonna understand it's an inside joke um, <laughs> so it's because of your hair that, my, that looks friends, like wheat? my friends and I came up with the roast saying that you had wheat hair and so we bought you wheat thins <laughs> and the spicy ones because you're spicy. <laughs> hey, spicy. Dude, hey, so look what spicy. I got. A book of famous explorers. Maybe one Thank day you, you can get in there. Dude, I'm in the book. I'm putting my name in the at the end of it so you know it's real. Bye Kayla. Bye. Take care. Thank you for driving out. It was, out Kayla. I hope it was worth it. Roasting queen, Mama Kayla out. <laughs> <laughs> So we have parked for the night, uh, that, that's the whole day. <laughs> we did a lot of driving today and we're actually doing even more driving tomorrow. The whole day is actually going to be driving. We're making our way down to Yellowstone and then eventually CVX. Uh, but that's it. Uh, thank you Kayla for coming out and driving out and thank you to your dad for driving out and uh, making that huge long trek just to see us. It was a lot of fun and uh, that's it for today. I will see you guys tomorrow in whatever state we end up in. <laughs> I'll see you then.